Hello guys, I hope you're all fine. Before going into the topic, I would like to do a small prayer in the name of Jesus Christ. So let's close your eyes. Heavenly Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil. For thine is kingdom, power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Hello guys, I hope you are all fine. Today we are here to discuss about the new developments in IPR, IPR of biological systems, computer software, etc. Here the first one is new developments of IPR. Some of the new developments in IPR are AI ownership clarification. There were new laws clarifying who owns the rights to inventions or creations made by artificial intelligence systems. Whereas the next one is green technologies and patents. Here government offered incentives and organized the patent process in order to encourage innovation in renewable energy recycling and other eco-friendly sectors. Whereas the next one is software patents. Here it continued, the government has continued discussion about the patentability of software. Whereas the next one is open access movement. Here there is a growing support for making research and content freely available to the public. In order to make uh, this research and uh, content uh, freely available to the public, there is a growing support. The first one, the next one is IPR of biological systems. The first one is plant variety protection, protecting new plant varieties developed through breeding. Where the next one is cooperate on genetic sequences. Here, protecting original works related to DNA or RNA sequences. Where the next one is cooperate on scientific publications. Here, protecting research papers and articles in the field of biology. Where the next one is trademark protection by, for biotech companies. Here, protecting the brand identities of companies operating in biotechnology sector. This is all about the IPR of biological systems. Whereas now we will discuss about uh, IPR of computer software. The first one is cooperate, it protects the original expressions of ideas in software code. Whereas the next one is patent, it grants exclusive rights to an invention like a unique software algorithm. Whereas the next one is trade secrets, it keeps uh, valuable information, valuable software information confidential from other competitors. Whereas the next one is trademark, here it protects uh, logos, names, and symbols associated with software brands. This is all about the IPR of software, computer software. This is all about the developments in IPR, IPR of biological systems and computer software, etc. I hope you understand, guys. Thank you.